Hey everybody, how you doing? This is going to be a quick video. Um, I'm working on my beehive and I needed to take a break on it because, well, it's just nothing but a... When you carve a beehive like this, this is kind of basically just a hobby hive. Hive. Have a plan. Don't just carve it and think it's going to work because then you're going to create a lot more work for yourself. But anyways, that's not what this video is about. This right here, this wood spirit on this root head, western red cedar. Okay, so what I originally did, this video is like a simple explanation what I mean by carve deeper and like Ryan Cook and all the chainsaw carvers and Dremel carvers means carve deeper. Carve deeper is a good way to fix your mistakes, okay? So I should have started this video earlier. So at first here I had it so he has had a cloak, this, this wood spirit. Here's a side view for you, just carve Rob. Look at the size of that nose, look how far it sticks off. So it looks like he had a cloak, okay? But I didn't like the way the cloak was fitting in with this piece. So then I just carved deeper and I cut it. And so all his hair is blowing up in the wind like that now. Okay, so you can see it. So I, I, can, I can just carve his mustache, his beard straight down and just leave it normal. But I want to I wanna have fun and challenge myself and just, just have a good time, right? So uh, it's not always about carving to try and sell a piece. So, you know, you think the way this hair goes, the wind's blowing whoosh, this way, right? It's blowing the hair up this way, but why can't I put that? Why can't I put the beard going this way, blowing this way? Like, whoosh, why can't I? Who's stopping me, right? So this is just a quick, simple explanation about carving deeper. So I already got his mustache, mustache up, carved in a little bit deep there. I didn't go too deep. So, but all I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna carve deeper. I'm gonna carve this here. I'm gonna carve this mustache here, and this one's gonna be blowing over here. And then his beard's gonna come around here. So I'm just gonna carve all this out. You're gonna see his mustache whoosh, blowing in the wind this way, and then that one's blowing this way, so it's a nice smooth piece, right? They don't both have to be blowing the same way. Okay, so I'm gonna do it on a time lapse so you guys can see what I get up to here, how I carve deeper. I'm gonna be using the Echo 2511. Love it! Okay, so this is a super quick time lapse. I realized um, editing the video, I that you can't really see what's going on so I made it super quick get to the point right so the bottom line is cut deeper the deeper you cut the better your carving is going to look I got to start cut cutting more carving more 3d three-dimensional things stop being such a 2d carver anyways carry on so there you go just carve deeper see how deep I had to carve this in Sometimes you gotta push your nose back, sometimes you gotta push, pushing back means carving deeper, okay? Sometimes you gotta push your eyebrows back, carve deeper, put your eyes back, take your nose down, sometimes you need to push your bottom lip, carve deeper. Just remember that everybody, carve deeper. And when you're trying to learn something, for me, the only way I can really get it is just go for it. That's, that's the bottom line, I just have to go for it and just, if it sucks at first, the first time, second, the tenth time, twentieth time, just keep going for it. You can do it. Trust me. Chainsaw carving, Dremel carving, wood spirits are simple to carve. They don't have to be, they don't have to look like wizards. A wood spirit is what you want it to be. Anyway, so that's carved deeper. So um, I'm going to finish this off. I'm not going to film and I'll show you guys what it looks like. Uh, and I'm going to try my best on these eyes. I'm going to try and make them round first, then... Like, I'm going to take my time. I'm in no rush today. Usually when I'm here, I'm rushing and I want to get things done and stuff. But today is no rush. Today is learning day for me. Like, I learned that you can make the beard go this way and the hair go that way. See how they both go the opposite ways? Everybody, I want to stop for a quick second here and uh, thank everybody for all the support. Uh, big shout out here to Brett Meredith. Um, hey, Brett. Thanks for the email, it was real touching. I'm sorry about the uh, terrible losses that your family's gone through. And uh, keep positive, keep at it, and um, just be happy, man. Sorry I don't have the pictures of your carvings. I was gonna share them, but I deleted them. I can't get them again, but um, thanks, Brett, and um, be happy. And say hi to your family for me. Thanks, bye. I don't know why, but in the morning time, I don't get this reflection down here put my hand over there but it's only like one in the afternoon and I got a reflection that reflection so sorry I got my door closed for filming and it's just weird 
I don't know. But there it is anyways. So it's easier for the very beginning carvers that want to learn how to carve eyes. These ones aren't that great, but you can see how deep they're sunken into the face, right? To try and make your eyes look one way. The hardest eyes to do are the ones that are looking straight at you. So try and make them look one way, right? See how that guy's looking? And I was just having fun carving, so I carved some spirit lines down here. Just going to leave it. So that's all. There's a, oh, uh, carve deeper. That's what this video is about. That's right. Carve deeper. Thanks, everybody. Take it easy, Brett. Oh, one more thing, too. Sign your pieces! Sign your pieces! And this is going to be my second video of carving deeper. I'll do two videos. So originally, I wanted to make this one a normal wood spirit, but now I decided it's such a neat root head. It's not very big. It's probably like four feet, maybe three and a half feet. I want to make it a green man. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to cut deeper, and let's do this. Abra cadabra. that rock up there with my chainsaw. Yeah, there's a rock here, see it? So, I'm not going to film this, I'm just bugging you guys. I, I've already got lots of Green Man videos out, but you can see I got the leaves. This is going to be a lot of carving, but probably a full day to finish this one, or half a day. So there's those two big twin brother root heads. I'm going to fix the eyes on this one a bit better. I'm going to carve them deeper, make it better. This one's pretty good. Let me warn you guys, you're going to make a bee house plan it better than I plan mine. That's the bottom line. Carving Fusion, over and out. It's going to be pissing out here for, for a full week. Maybe I should stay home and Dremel carve. What do you guys think? <laughs>